Welcome to the midweek message from First Grapevine, a United Methodist Church. We're glad you've joined us. Please take a moment and let us know you are watching by registering on our church website or mobile app. We hope this encouraging word will be a blessing for the middle of your week. Hi, I'm Grant, and I want to tell you something that's happening with our little midweek message. Uh, we, this is something that we started when the pandemic hit to try to create extra content to have more points of contact with you during the week because we weren't able to meet together in person. We had some great experiences. I loved having different lay people come on to talk about missions that they're involved with, Miriam Ward, Deb Shivey, and several other people. We even had a chance to sit down with people from the conference office. Clifton Howard came and talked to us about racism in our church and in our country. We had the bishop, Bishop Mike Lowry, come and, and share with us about the life of the church despite the challenges that we're facing. We also, one of my personal favorites was getting to sit down with uh, re retired Lieutenant Colonel Tony Waterbury, talk about God and country, and just doing our best to make it through this COVID-19 pandemic. But we have been discerning, praying, thinking about how to best make content during the week to go on the internet so that we can continue to learn and grow and we decided we wanted to make uh, so many changes and, and wanted to try to improve in so many ways that formally the midweek message is coming to an end. I really appreciate all of the support that you gave this effort. Uh, thank you so much for watching and for those of you who volunteered to be a part to help make this happen. Don't worry, we're still going to have stuff that we're putting out. We've got some amazing things planned, but we just can't do all of it at the same time. So thanks again for supporting the midweek. Uh, I guess this is uh, officially the last one. And it, it ends the same way it began with me standing up here and, and saying to you at home, thank you for all you do. And we'll see you soon. For current information about the effects of COVID-19 precautions at First Grapevine Church, visit firstgrapevine.org slash COVID-19 updates.